To begin with, uh, we have this concept of the people from other planets as little green men. Um, are they green from what you know? Uh, are they all the same? Help us out. Unfortunately, uh, they're, not, they're not so benevolent. A fucking alien. What's good, what's good? Welcome here, 51 here with your host Jimmy. Another day in the jungle. Give us a like, subscribe, and also become part of our community here in GoldenOutBoxing.com for more news and more stories. All right, so let's get to this video. So right after the fight with Maxi Huchis, George Cambosos Jr. announced that he was going to fight Vasil Lomachenko. That's he's looking forward to fight next. And this is probably the next fight for Vasil Lomachenko. They try to make this fight happen um, a while back before Vasil Lomachenko went to war. At that particular time, George Cambosos Jr., after being Teofimo Lopez, had said that he would actually fight Devin Haney and he ended up trying to fight Vasil Lomachenko. If he would have fought Devin Haney, he would have been a real undisputed champion. He knew that. So Vasil Lomachenko, because of Ukraine, he had to fight Devin Haney, and that was for an undisputed championship, but he was kind of forced to do so. But now he's announced that he wants to fight Vasil Lomachenko next, and Vasil Lomachenko has been very quiet lately, okay? Now, I don't have a problem with this fight per se, but I do have a problem with Vasil Lomachenko. Vasil Lomachenko said to Shakur Stevenson that he would be fighting or he would attempt to fight Devin Haney, okay? No contract from Bob Arum, who is the promoter of Vasil Lomachenko, ever ended up in Devin Haney's or Bill Haney's desk. So that never happened, okay? So there was no attempt of that. And he's ranked number one as a mandatory for Devin Haney. So Shakur Stevenson said, let's go ahead and make this fight happen. And since Vasil Lomachenko said, well, not right now. No, sorry. I want to try to, I'm going to try to fight Devin Haney. If he ends up fighting George Cambosos Jr. instead, then that means he's ducking Shakur Stevenson. I mean, you say you want Devin Haney and that's why you're not fighting Shakur Stevenson. Because Shakur Stevenson is, is in your same promotional company. I mean, he's with Bob Arum too, right? But you don't want Shakur Stevenson because you're trying to fight Devin Haney. This is what you're telling. This is what you're telling everybody. And now you're trying to fight George Cambosis Jr. And that's why you're quiet. I, I Vasilo Machenko, man. Um, I don't know why people are so absorbed with this man. I'm not saying he's a bad fighter. He's, he's a good fighter. But call a spade a spade, man. Like, this guy is not willing to fight Shakur Stevenson. So he's obviously ducking Shakur Stevenson. And if he ends up fighting George Cambosos Jr., uh, it's a clear sign that, you know, this guy is a hype job. I mean, unbelievable. You sacrifice... Shakur Stevenson for George Cambosos Jr. And no offer or is being sent to Devin Haney. So he is probably going to fight George Cambosos. Uh, I'm not going to say anything else. You guys who are fans of Basil Lomachenko, you guys give this guy too much credit. And at the end of the day, this is the type of shit that happens. So now you know if he fights him, it's total duck. Peace out, give us a like, V's, and I'll see you in the next video.